Oh, God. <laughs> Watch this so many times oh. now. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first I've seen this one, actually. I haven't, this is my first time, too. I just oh, want to point funny. out, I said it before on this one, the insinuation here is that he's so fat he breaks the scale. Not that he <laughs> punches it, but he's breaking a scale. <laughs> <laughs> That's so alpha be like, fuck the scale. Oh, Tommy Temple? That's a pretty good Photoshop. Yeah. Fuck you, you didn't do it. Let's get it on! <laughs> this is supposed to make us not want to make fun of him because we respect he, him now. Why is he punching you with the top of his hand? Because like, <laughs> that's where, he, that's, <laughs> that's where that's, it hurts that's, the most. Why are you even doing this? Put, put a bar over his tits. It's just backhanded. It, it'll hurt more than this. Wait till he starts putting his hands up when Nick tells it's, him to put his hands like up. this part of his hand. Yeah. He built well, like a lockdown. This is, recent, this is recent, right? Yeah, oh, it was yeah. just like two days ago. He's got a great farmer's stand going on. Yeah. I like how he shakes before every punch. Yeah. Yeah, Truckers, you know. Yeah, so what we were just talking about he, with the, the grandma flaps. He's a... Uh, uh, he punches like a punch out... No, he Enemy. punches like, like a man key. He's, He's glass like Joe. He's like out there. He punches like hand simulator or like if you're playing Wii Boxing and the can, the Wii Mode's dying. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. Wow. I, ah. shit. I, lost like, I lost like 17 pounds since my Come last doctor's people. visit in June. Let's go. Oh. More than that, actually. <laughs> Come as old. Mockery thy be. Or like, so mockery so thy me. He's going to react to my food review. I do order. love how he burns 500 calories and eats 5,000. Yes, <laughs> so awesome. Channel. 500 would be very oh, generous man. for that workout. That's so he did. funny, Tom. I didn't even think of that as a possibility. I knew it was a possibility. <laughs> so he's going to roast me here. I'm sure many of you oh, have seen this. Goldie Colin, he has an obsession with Mike L. Love. I don't know what's. I've heard this. about it. But let's react to Tom's shitty food reviews. Okay. Episode 10. Really, dude? You're making fun of episode 10? I'm gonna listen to this whole video because we're on Twitch. Don't you dare file a copyright. I will take you to ass to court and sue the fuck out of you, motherfucker. Okay. Okay, so... This video was... On Christmas Eve. What the fuck? Why are you dressed like Dracula? Oh my god. Hold on. Let's get this working on here. So, Hold the anybody who doesn't know, the entire month of October, I did three food reviews each week. And in one of the reviews, we had Dracula step in for me. And uh, so we kept him on Patreon. And then after October... We started uploading one a week around there, right? And uh, so this one was uploaded on December 24th. The fuck on? Who the hell up? So he thinks I uploaded it on Christmas. Well, I don't know what Pick Rob is that you're talking about. Shut the fuck up. Uh, Pick Rob is your pedophile friend. <laughs> What's in the mouth noises he's making? We're going to watch this video, then I'm going to pause and give you my thoughts. Let's play this little loser's video. He loves me so much. Oh my god. Let's see if the fucking thing's even working. Hold on. So it's not working for him. Did Tom curse the fucking Streamlabs? It's not even fucking working. Hold <laughs> on, fuck on. He can't figure out how to get Hold it to work. Hold the fuck on. Nothing's working. Hold the fuck on. There we go. Great stream so far, outlaw. Swat, Let's welcome back with a nine months. Thank you, Twitch baby. Okay, back to us. Here we go. Let's play it. Yeah, don't want to miss that. Oh my god, is he trying to copy Mike Outlaw with those fucking videos? Jesus Christ, dude. It's a good looking guy. Oh, who's that good looking guy? 
Dracula, what the fuck? Dude, it's Christmas Eve, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, Dracula, a uh, Dracula made a, uh, an appearance for us. First and foremost, let's give a pause right here. Let's give a pause right here. Anyways, guys. Pause on here. Mockery thy be. I will mock losers. And the loser today is Tommy Pimple. Let's go. Let's Trying go. to do your cosplay review. On Christmas. Hold on, hold on. I want to show myself really quick. So people Why? think it's a fucking pre-recording. It's okay, pre-recorded? This thing's being really fucking stupid. Uh, it's, I'm sure it's that thing being stupid, not you. He can't figure out how to put... First and foremost, Tommy Pimple! He can't figure out how to put the different layers and how to get the media <laughs> in front or <laughs> behind him. Man, uh, on OBS, you can change where you want stuff. So now I'm behind, now I'm in front. It's very simple. It's very, very simple. Oh, Christmas Eve? Why? It's the third time he's mentioned Christmas. Oh, you're not dressed up like Santa Claus or an elf. Instead, you have to be Dracula? What? What the fuck, dude? That makes no fucking sense at all. Dressed as Dracula on Christmas Eve? The fourth time he's mentioned Christmas. Oh my god. <sighs> oh man. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Gosh, she got teleported. Oh, Gosh, where'd she disappear? <laughs> he's like looking around, where'd she go? She's just here. <coughs> she despawned. <laughs> yeah, she reset. <laughs> <laughs> Look, she's over on the dock. <laughs> she respawned. <laughs> <She's like, "Hey, laughs> she's yelling, come get me! <laughs> I lost all my items. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Look, it's rust. Ah, oh, fuck, I fell off the boat. I got, I got my it. inventory, it's in the water. Hey, it's such a good gun. God damn, that's hitting hard. Or pissing people off by by telling others like, hey, don't go on there, but they get they take kids they don't know on that boat. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't. They, they, take, they, say, they tell kids that they, they, take, they have a bunch of twinks out on the deck. <laughs> they, take, they tell kids parents are going to take them off for a ride out just on the bay and they take them deep out in the ocean. They're traffickers. Just the only Trumpers traffickers. <laughs> These guys are doing Molly with twinks out there. <laughs> the only people Trump likes traffickers to their face in front of other people. I mean, that's literally what those fucking people do to anything anyway. I heard they were doing trans stuff out on the water. <laughs> what? We got a guy fucking coronary just saying that. Oh. I heard him and his wife switch clothes. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. International waters. God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yo, that guy over there in that boat, I heard his kid identifies as a piece of poop <laughs> at school. <laughs> what? <laughs> no! <laughs> that guy takes only ki his, his fr kid's friends on the boat and he pinches them all when they get out to the deep water. <laughs> Pinches that's how that pinch in your kid. Well, that's, he pulled that, up in his boat. That's next for the Nate arc, is living on a boat like the Boston Dad. Oh, you're letting your kids get on pinch or four? Okay. We call therapy for out here. You see that guy? That guy that looks like a minion. He's got the yellow hat on. He just pinched your kid. Pinch your kid. He wouldn't let go. When your kid yelped, he yelped too to like act like they were playing a game. I don't know. It was pinched weird. him like a crawdad. Chad, that's one of my social engineering moves. We don't like somebody in public. You can go up to somebody with a kid and you can point them out and say, that guy over there is pinching the fucking shit out of your kid. It made me sick. I gotta go up and throw up. <laughs> and they'll be like, what the fuck? And they'll go over there and then, you know, mm -hmm. Walter are ruined. And they have a, you have no people. way you have no way of proving that you didn't pinch someone's kid. Make it worse be like the guy pinched your kid instead of he tells him but he's gonna kill him. <laughs> <laughs> that guy put a gun to your kid's head. 
You would have to be, you would have to be like, oh, good at talking your way through things to get out of that. Well, like, yeah. that's like the diet version of being accused of like being a pedophile or something. It's just it's, like, yeah, it's, but it's so, so inconvenient. It's so weird. It's so it's weird. weird. Like, people like, that has to be true. Why would they say it? People nearby would hear that and it's like, well, enough, they'd stay around and be like, what the fuck? <laughs> you have to fucking move if that happened yeah. to you. <laughs> you would have to. It would be like the hunt with Mads Mickelson. Picture. Where he's like the teacher have, that's yeah. accused of being a pedophile and he's not. He's innocent. But instead it's just Jack is getting accused of pinching someone's skin. <laughs> like, well, Jack's an asshole. Really so they probably didn't do it. Friends call him five guys. You would, like, if you were with a group of, like, <laughs> at least ten people, at least two people would automatically hey, believe someone who accused Lily you Lewis of that. Lily Lewis thanks for the ten months. I'm from Seinfeld. Oh, <laughs> wow. Yeah, bro, bro. <laughs> Makes I love you all would, of paid for accounts. That is such, that is, like, Michael, that is like what Nicole would set up uh, Bobby Gordon with. <laughs> she just leaves a note at one police plaza. Hey, I'm a mom and Bob Detective Gordon pinched my son. Process this on low for about one or two minutes. The resulting product should look a little like this. Kind of smells and looks like Chapo Trap House, if you know what I mean. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's your food that you made. If you want the best, yeah. Go to Redmond Life and use the code. He's mad at me. And I've done nothing wrong. In the original mac and cheese video, just watching his videos and saying, "Look at that gray meat." Lazy. Simply grab two spoons and drop little dumplings right. I mean, he's he's making like noodles out of ground chicken. This fucking sucks. This is why we need your resubs always because it's going to be maybe getting a letter from the meat lawyer as well. Yeah, it's going to be written on parchment because it has to be animal. There's going to be a... <laughs> I'm going to wake up tomorrow. There's just like a flank steak in my bed. <laughs> the rest of the horse except for the head is in your bed. <laughs> Finally, we can get on to the main event. All this guy is with this diet should have to do the JSON check where he posts his white underwear to flex. Thank you, ACC. Like, yup, no poop in this motherfucker's underwear. If there's a lot no bottom half shower today. Not miss, thank you. Five thank you. Five gifted le and are legal events from the meat lawyer. They are. Once we've gotten their underwear is not white. Black pepper. Chat, a lot of you probably know who this guy is by now, but if you don't, this is Frank Fleming. He's a guy who's, he's basically his job is, he's like a jester kind of. And Dave Portnoy owns him legally. He's property of Dave Portnoy. He won him in a casino. Yeah. He said, it's right, we're taking a pound of ground beef. We're tossing it in. Dave Fortnite. That's right. And we're going to heat it up. Man, this guy really likes baseball. Yep. He likes it, but he doesn't like it because he screams through every game. And he streams it a lot of the time. Yep. It's gonna, he stopped doing it, but back. Well, maybe he'll do it when the NFL's back on. But he would sit on. He'd sit live on YouTube and react to Dolphins games, and they lose a lot. And every time they lose, he'd crack his glasses in half and bite his shirt. That's why his shirt looks like that. And at Barstool, they have a big box of, of his glasses in bulk because he always snaps them and bites them. Oh. Half of their budget is on shirts for him. We've been watching him for far longer than he's worked at Bu uh, BuzzFeed. Shit, I wish. Barstool. Yeah, we started watching him between when he went viral and when Barstool hired him. He, w he went viral for a video where he was complaining about New Jersey Transit being late. Well, I think it was on the news and he was screaming and acting like a big baby. And uh, it went viral. Which one is M. Hud? I'm the white guy. <laughs> Come on. The guy with the beard. Yeah, the guy with the beard. Here you go. See, I should play like a little Dave. bit of his grilling video. If the bag would open, that would be nice. Where he does the thing in a video game where you leave food on the fire too long and it turns into coal. <laughs> All right. He um nice he does this thing that. I don't know if this is like a super common thing, but you know when someone sings and you can hear that they're singing because they have like a lot of unrestrained rage, like just yes. barely restrained rage, just like, yep. and now I'm making a joke and it's funny. I hate that shit like, so died. much. <laughs> yeah. It reminds you me need... of like bosses I had in retail that always sounded like they were going to either cry or shoot. Mm. Doesn't look good. No. This is for his dog though, it's fine. Or... <laughs> It's mixed up. This is if you want your dog to shit a lot. 
If your dog's sitting and you want to ruin someone's house, just make the dog this. <laughs> this is what you make if you have a crush on your vet. <laughs> God damn it. You're breaking up with someone and you want to give the dog diarrhea when you leave. <laughs> so they have to clean it up, so you make this and give it to the dog. <laughs> That's the purpose of this. Pose it. All right, let's see how these ribs are. If found, return to Dave Portnoy, yeah. yeah. Put on first little coating of barbecue sauce. You got him chipped. It. Frank was excited for that one, then he was really not excited. Yeah, we're getting you a chip. Oh, wow. Hey, Frank, do you love chips? Bucky's yes, you do. Come sauce. here. So let's get some Bucky's barbecue sauce on here. Okay. We're going to keep the, the meat Looking moist. good. Yes, that's... Sizzling. By the way, chat, this mutant no. of a man is another guy who's really into uh, women's college swimming all of a sudden, if you know what I mean. 30 minutes. Oh, man. All right, this has been cooking now about 45 minutes, so we're going to put these potatoes in and this corner grill. I don't like that. It charred up? What the fuck? I think what you're under... Saying something. it charred up is underselling it. <laughs> <laughs> it turned oh, into coal. Gun. It turned into usable coal as an item. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. It looks like someone stole the ribs and put coal there. Like, <laughs> it doesn't look like that's the byproduct of a natural process. He's trying to make high quality metal. It's good that he has those sheets. Is it, they wouldn't have cleaned that up if it was on the. He's doing his IOL grill. rust raid. I'm He's doing small grill. I'll be back. <laughs> what are your dream blunt rotations? I'm not really sure how to answer that because I don't know what um, it means. Uh, yeah, they didn't. Blunt, um, they don't know what that is. I have is. no idea what that actually means. Might have to be more specific. But, uh, more specific. Might have to be more specific. <laughs> oh, okay. So we kind of understand a little bit more. But uh, He just said specific. Well, that's true. They do need to be more specific. Right now, he's a little more Atlantic about half a country over would be a little bit more pacific so he's technically correct actually i apologize um if there's a flavor that i would like to be made in a blunt it's probably like sodas and stuff Ooh, yeah like <sighs> fucking hell if he says pepsi flavored blunt <laughs> it's oh well my god if he says pepsi flavored blunt uh, for anybody who doesn't know, my chair had two armrests, and the right one broke off. And it broke off because every time he would fucking say some dumb shit, I would hit it. I would hit it and hit it and hit it. And it finally broke off. So now, I don't have any way to let this aggression I have go. And I just have to sit and take it. Mountain Dew, I mean, ooh, yeah, Pepsi, Pepsi like God a damn it! Or something. I knew it! Dr. Pepper, root beer, maybe root something beer, like that. probably, I mean, yeah, yeah. That would be cool. <sighs> probably something like that. I mean, I don't know what they're talking about. Blunt rotation. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what they're talking about. Blunt. I don't have COVID. I can promise you. Ooh. Brad is horned up. That's right. What's he watching? He's probably watching porn. He's baked, guys. He's baked. He, oh, my God. Dude, you know what's really gross? You know what's really, really, really gross to think about is, you know, they're talking about walk, watching porn, and they're definitely getting horny. So when they when he sleeps over, they have a cot that Brad sleeps on next to Vinny's bed. And you know, you know when they think the other is asleep, they roll over to their side B ran, what's that noise? Huh? <laughs> Christ. Look at this shit. One thing I love about this video is you don't have to listen to it. Yeah, you can't hear a single word he's saying and it doesn't even matter. You just get to watch him fuck up and get banned from the gym for banging the thing against the. This is supposed to intimidate us or something. It's just. <laughs> I would fucking. Sm I could literally- Why would you ever upload this to the internet, dog? I could- He's hitting it at the other side? He's hitting it at Why? the glass. Why? 
so Nick can film it or something? I don't know. He's gonna get- gonna... Also, he's wearing hiking boots. Yeah, it's such bad etiquette. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I didn't realize it's the actual gym floor right there, too. Yeah, Oh this... my god. My- okay. My job at Lifetime would be to kick him out. I yeah, know. like he is- I would be approached by a general manager and he would kind of motion to outlaw. So my general manager was like a Christian Troy from Nip Tuck type motherfucker. And he would probably look at Outlaw and get like the piss shivers, like the willies. He'd be so grossed out by him, be like, "Can you go talk to that guy?" I mean, all you would have to do is look at him wearing disgusted. hiking boots and say, "Okay, he can't be in here." Oh, I want him to shatter the glass so bad. It was against the wall, so not much you can do there. Oh God, I forgot Nick's even there. Nasty little guy. He's filming and he's touching his little pecker. His fucking hiking boots. I hate him so much. It's so Good ridiculous. How does this happen? It's, um, Alex that watched me, and so did um, Mike. Oh, yeah, it's on the Triple Crap House. Uh, the Triple Crap House. On a channel. Yeah. Those two guys are trolling you. Trolling your remote workout video. Yeah, what was it? Um, uh, that guy named Mike Cole. Yeah, he said he could beat you at it. No. Yeah, uh, he wants to join the gym and get you banned from, get you banned from the gym. It's gonna be up opposite. He'll probably be banned from the gym. because he said you weren't wearing proper shoes and they could scratch the court. No, those shoes are fine. So you really, can, you should. Those are shoes. Those are you not. You really should get. No, you really should get proper workout shoes because it's, you know, you could streak. The, the problem is you could uh, leave streaks on the court. No, those shoes are fine. I talked to the guy at the gym. He said it's fine. They're just regular shoes yeah, I wear. Well, I mean, they're well, not, dude. Well, the only thing they are are steel toe shoes. Toed. What? He doesn't know they're steel toe shoes. Oh, he's not very educated, is he? <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, you should wear. You know, it, it's it's proper. It's better for your foot. You know, your posture also. I do not wear boots at the fucking gym. Oh, no way. I don't wear boots. That hurt me. Those are shoes. She also, um, she loved watching television. She loved, she loved watching movies. Clearly. Um, she had, she was a big fan of, of Toy Story. She loved Toy Story a lot. I wonder why. <laughs> and her favorite superhero Buzz was Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. She loved Buzz Lightyear. Is he a superhero? So much. She was nuts about Isn't him. Isn't he just a toy? And the, uh, the like funniest a thing man? was is that, why Buzz Lightyear? Mm-hmm. And she said this. He was the coolest toy ever made in the 90s. Okay. The coolest toy of all. And that's That's the why she loved him so much. All right. He, he had that... Um, Who am I to disagree? That buzzing thing or whatever, that laser. <laughs> the buzzing thing. He had a button buzz, buzz. that would, his wings would pop out. Oh, uh, what the fuck? What the fuck are we talking about here? He's talking about fucking Buzz Lightyear. It, it's, 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 <laughs> it's a eulogy. And he's just like, Buzz Lightyear. Uh, he had a button and he had the buzzer. <laughs> what? Who fucking cares? I'm yelling. I'm yelling. I didn't want to yell. I have like a sore throat. I've had a sore throat all week. <laughs> and this, this is not helping. And as all, also his helmet when he taps that little thing that to open the helmet or close it back up. Okay. She said he was a cool toy. Shut the fuck he up! Him so much. Move on from Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> if Brad knew he was going over to Vince's house, right? And this is going to get graphic. If Brad knew, Thatcher, thank you. Brad was like, okay, this weekend, I'm going to Vince's house. He's got to work on Saturday. You know what he'd do? He wouldn't jack off the whole week. Guarantee you. Guarantee you. He would just keep it in. Uh, uh, uh. He's in the work bathroom, and he's like, nope, not today. Not today. I'm going over to Vince's this weekend. Vince would go up. Boom. 11 o'clock, Vince goes to work. Boom. 1 p.m., Brad gets up. 
He r- rolls out of his cot, sees Amber on the bed, and is just like, boom, ba, 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 and just whoosh, explodes in her. Makes a mess. Adds to the bizarre, right? Proceeds, wait another like 15 minutes, do it again, right? Another 45 minutes at this point, do it again. Uh, probably like four or five times. Brad did not know how to use lube either, but this is the thing. He's already sort of, uh, to put it nicely, he's already uh, gave her an incredible cream pie, so he's using his own semen as a lubricant, so it's not a big deal. He doesn't need a lubricant. Is there a problem? Am I not allowed? It's just, it's what happened. It's what happened. You can be upset with me, but those are just facts. Thank you, Dan. Fuck! Stream's over! They're just facts. Okay? ...together, Super Nintendo, they play games together. What else Um, do they do? She just loved hanging out with him. Mm -hmm. But the memory that she would never forget when spending time with me and B-Rad was dancing all over him, on top of him, when B-Rad was passed out on the floor. <laughs> and it's an incredible memory. Um, B-Rad was, um, was smoking a little too much, and we were all in the blacklight room, and we had music playing, and Amber and I were dancing, and we were also doing karaoke as well. B-Rad passed out on the floor, and he died one like of, a um, dog. Amber and I's songs came he on. He died like a coward. And we were dancing, and Amber started dancing on top of him while he was passed out on the floor. <laughs> That's a memory that she'll never forget. And she just... She will forget it because she's dead. But if I went to my friend's house... Now, granted, if I knew my friend had a sex doll, I uh, wouldn't go over to his house. And I probably wouldn't invite him over to my house. Um... <laughs> But you go over to your friend's house and let's say you're just drinking, you're hanging out, you fall asleep and you wake up and your friend has like a sex doll and he's just sort of dancing her on you. I think I would kill him. I think I would get up and just kill him immediately. Travel gobble. I'll come back. Nine months. She loved B-Rad so much like a brother. She loved him so much. More than her brother. And he Kinda was like a, a step brother. <laughs> and B Rad, if you're watching She used to get stuck in the dryer. She's gonna let you know that she loves you. She doesn't love you. She and you loved are you. Like a big brother to her. So she wants to thank you for being part of her life and accepting for who she is. So she wants to say thank Step-sister you. Stepsister love doll stuck in dryer? Number eight. Her favorite memory was going bowling with me. And I think you guys should remember on Amber Live when I took her bowling to round one for the very first time. Yep. And I remember. She loved that moment so much because every time I get a strike, she gets one of my kisses. And it if stinks. I get a spare, and he didn't get that many strikes, I get so she a high loved five it. From her or a hug. Or a hug. And she loved it. She can't even bowl or anything like that. But I decided to do something like that, so she'll be part of it no matter what. Mm-hmm. So she loved the idea. So she had a great time bowling with me. She uh, what about me. the family that was next to you and the lane, two lanes and next to you? Did they did have a great that time? She could bowl, but she just couldn't. I believe using a certain lubricant on it can also create like the plastic of her vagina to mold together and basically shut off and so it can kind of just like fuck up everything i think it was like oil-based lubricant will do that um and then i think her body parts were breaking off and uh he never cleaned her never washed her out so there was a big bazaar in there and every time he dropped her on the bed Um, a little bit of a basically kind of like a dried cum spider ball (laughs) would break apart and it would puff out. 
Montreal wasted. Oh, Mi Montreal, Montreal wasted okay. instead of <laughs> municipal <laughs> waste. Montreal, Montreal wasted. wasted. <laughs> I'm glad right. we watched this far into it. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got to keep it. Montreal, yeah, right Montreal, Montreal wasted. <laughs> Montreal wasted. Come on, man. Wait, was Montreal wasted? He read it right. Is it a actually? One. Yeah. No way. Montreal. Is that the name of the band? Looks like we're stupid. Montreal wasted. Maybe that's their name. Oh, wow. Wow, I guess the joke's on you oh, guys. Oh, no. Bad, okay. I guess it's the same font. don't really care for if they are... Uh, I guess where the is it? In the thorn <laughs> Scotty's front. nose. It's very hard to be able to read. I'm trying to identify who I Wait like a minute. as far as Hold on. Uh, music bands that I'm... This is I'm weird. And, because that's and not a band. You can't... Read. Yeah, no, I looked, here. I looked it up. That's for always. What, the the yeah, one no, thing that comes up... It was the font. I don't think it was anything. Dude, so it must just be like an Alibaba type thing. Yeah, I mean... Hold on. Wait a minute. Anything that just say rock. It is municipal waste. It is municipal waste, dude. Nice. Hold on. We got to go back. It is It is municipal waste. Alex, click my link. Montreal wasted? Yeah, I have that open. Yeah, okay, it's, yeah, yeah, someone yeah. else said it's a uh, someone else has it oh, listed yeah, as it so yeah the only uh, the only result for Montreal wasted is someone else selling the municipal <laughs> waste patch the same exact patch on eBay <laughs> and getting true. it wrong like it had to be it but the way he was holding it I was like okay it's some, it must be like a fuck up or like a cover band or something it was just I'm not gonna put it was the same font it's so not, funny yeah it was like almost, yeah, it's, yeah it's, like he really just thought it was uh, read what's on Montreal wasted. Montreal Wasted. Yeah, we can all laugh again at Montreal Wasted, so, guys. Woo! Yeah, it's not a real band. And if Let's get those laughs out, guys. If they are... Brenda, going to second date. Oh. I'm like 30. Brenda. Excuse me? Bre that harlot <laughs> Brenda. <laughs> Sucking your husband's dick? I love the light fixture covers never being put on after they took it off to change the light bulb. Yeah, oh, absolutely. I also they, like that this like is being only played through the Bluetooth bulb? speaker with the LEDs. Yeah. The tape of her husband cheating. Which somehow you oh, have a tape. Oh, wait, hold on. Somehow, somehow you have a tape of your husband getting a blowjob from Brenda? <laughs> I don't want to listen. <laughs> what is this recorded on? Maybe they re were recording it? And she found uh, it. Uh, like voice Vince, Vince left his podcast set up on. <laughs> what the fuck? Brenda, how could you Man. do this? I hate Brenda, dude. Brenda, you, oh no. Ma'am, ma'am, you can't be doing this. You can't be posting this on YouTube. Brenda, you dirty dog. Ma'am, I don't get that hear. cock out of your He's mouth. He's gonna bust. He's gonna bust. <laughs> Oh God! Oh! <laughs> he went. Ugh. Oh, Look, he's nuts. <laughs> this is just <laughs> gross all around. <laughs> it's like being here. being a guy who does that. Being a guy who's like, oh, oh, <laughs> 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 like, scream! Like, come on, man! Look, my nuts. Uh, Oh, babe, you want to suck my cock? I'm a groaner. <laughs> wow, this is this is incredible. This is like so gross, man. <laughs> man I watched like a little bit earlier just to see like the kind of screen it, and I turned it off before the moment. You didn't know. It was I have no fucking idea. Audio recording of her I husband mean, getting his dick sucked so, by Brenda. How could you think that they would have an audio? Yeah, this, this is the Smule lady. Back. It's the Smule what lady. What the fuck is happening? They sound like the Terry's fucking. It really is. It's the. It's Tastes like, like metal. Oh, uh, what? She's like a. She, it's like it's like she's playing a character. She's playing this oh, character of like yeah. the, I was I like the the first wife in Goodfellas or something like that. Like oh, I used to be beautiful. Now you want someone else? When I was like it's 12 ridiculous. years old and I heard Dave Attell make a oh, lot lizard joke on Insomniac, yeah. it's exactly oh, the woman I pictured. Mm -hmm. This was a lot lizard. Yeah, he died. His ass exploded. 
eating a real big, gross mess of food in his car. Yeah, can't even see it, man. Hey, great filming, Brian. That's basically what he's thinking this bag is me. I, I was so scared because he was going to sue me. You knew that. <laughs> 46 months. He was going to call his lawyer. Pro bono. For a defamation suit against me who's done nothing wrong. <laughs> Imagine being on the receiving end of these punches. Oh! Time for the goblin squats. Or 12. You mean Hungarian goblin squats? No, it's a goblin because I crush goblins. Oh, <laughs> okay, let's go do some squats. Ow! Okay. Okay. Ow! Okay. Okay. Ow! Don't put me near his ass. Ow! Now that's just, that's fucked up. That's very fucked up. Okay? Can't believe this dead guy. This dead guy would make this video about me. Put me near a stinky ass. He's so creepy. He's so fucking creepy. He wishes. He wishes. This is a man, mind again. This is a man who has sex dreams about me. I'm not owned. He's so obsessed with me. This, this is a married man. Married to his wife, who hates him, of course. His family hates him. I'm not owned. <laughs> uh... And he has disgusting sexual dreams about me. He spends his birthday making wishes that he'll be nice to him, which is not going to happen. I go, I never win. I'm always, I'm always under attack from somebody. That is supposed to be me. Yes, that is supposed to be me. I think you know why, Quail Boy. I think you also know why he wants to sit on my face. And the answer is no. No outlaw. No. Is, has there been an apology? He's never apologized to me. He threatened me. He DMs me on Twitter to threaten me. And then he <laughs> DMs me like two hours later to see if we can do a collab together. There's no... There's no fucking... <laughs> uh, he hates me because he wants to be a baby again. That's pretty much the best way to sort of sum it up. He used to go on forums, ask to be a baby. Then he had a forum with his friend Brian, who he's working out with, where they talked about teenage girls a lot. Um, they talked to teenage girls while they were in their mid to late 20s. His dad's friend not letting him drink a margarita. Overall, just bad guy. And, you know, I don't like bad guys. So they don't like me. It's like... But I've done nothing wrong. He would come on the stream in a second. Oh, are you kidding me? He's a fucking clout shark. He is... He, he's clout law. That's what he wants. He wants the attention. He wants to be on the stream. He, But he's so boring. I can't and, uh, breathe. Can <laughs> anyone get on Jizz Talking? To go hey, everybody. Welcome to another edition of Jizz Talking for a Sunday night. Wow. We have a bit of a schedule change. They shouldn't sell these girls. glasses anymore, to except to women. Rex Radiation. Well, she's not to a guy doing Jizz Talking. This was After, uploaded, uh, Karen, like, today. 35 minutes ago. Earlier today no, and wow, dude. Lord. This is Scotty Allen Day edited. No problem there. But anyway, uh... Smooth out. What's up, Bodacious? Porn Talks Rival. Having you on anyway, Rex. So hey, you bogus beast. <laughs> Here we are. It's Here a podcast are. about porn. You ought interviews like porn actors and stuff. Start. Once upon a time. Oh, okay, so he's pro porn. Time. Yeah. Rex, start from where you're well, that's cool. Yes. Bro, At least he's at getting the jizz out. Y'all, I'm going fishing with a PH. I'm going hey, fucking. Parker. Nick Nolte. Nick Naughty. <laughs> I'm going to be the temporary MC. I will call on us to come and uh, offer whatever you'd like to offer to Kay. I'm sure Kay is here. Dick Pacheco. Um, and she may make herself... Kay Parker was a else. British pornographic film actress. It'd be so awesome if, you're, yeah. if your funeral was on Jizz Talk talking. Yeah. So I was saying something, Cindy. This is the Boogie Nights characters that didn't die from coke or shooting, getting shot. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> in love with Kay. And, 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 and Holy have, fuck! Having I thought that was what's his face. Relations, it was Bill De Blasio. It was beyond, <laughs> you know, it was like, 
wow, this is uh, so special. And her sense of humor came out. There was never a, a thought that she was uncomfortable or anything else. We had the best time. And um, the next situation... And I came I in my condom. Kitty. I mean, I, 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 <laughs> we were in a movie uh, by Cavalero, which was one of the largest production companies at the time. And they did this feature called Nasty Nurses. <laughs> Thank you for the footnote. Which was Nasty Nurses. By, by this is a funeral. I mean, this is really... Nasty fucking nurses. Dollars. Pretty incredible content. <laughs> Everything was great about the movie. To be able to sit in on this. Name, nasty mm -hmm. Nurses. I love it. John Legendary. <laughs> some anyway, Nick Mullen shit, man. John Legendary. <laughs> they had an abandoned <laughs> hospital for us. Dude, her family is just sitting there listening to this. Yeah, this is her Look funeral. Old, Look at those old Brits. It's like Josh Gad playing Adam Kroll in a movie. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's uh, that's that's Patton Oswalt playing Chester Bennington from Lincoln Park. What is the saying goes? God created the earth and the heavens, and Bill Margold created himself. Oh, yeah. I think that was on his business card. Thank you, Bill Barr. Hey everybody, welcome to another Dr. Reese Rideout. On Sunday, we certainly want to thank our guest this week for. Oh, they had doctor up. on here. We had uh, another guest that was supposed to be with us. She looked me up and down and said, "You're in really good shape. Why don't you do Playgirl?" And this I this guy said, loves talking to about <laughs> this fucking so, cock. She took a roll of film of me, thirty-six pictures. Um, she wore heavy glasses. Don't. This isn't even the doctor. Into the adult industry. <laughs> I hope that's not the doctor. <laughs> I don't think so. The industry, or they would have to start out in. Like, no, that's a different guy. This is Wally Walla. You know, porn or whatever. Is that still like how it is? Uh, it's so so different now. <laughs> there he is. Um, he did a bunch of pornos where he's doing a vision test and he's looking at the some, thing and it's like S E X. <laughs> this is, is Doctor Dick respect. And, and marketers because they know who their audience is so dr if, reese right now it's so funny over, that he has a stethoscope like he's at his house <laughs> he's just on the porch i mean i've been turning well, thank you appreciate it yeah, absolutely <laughs> oh nice thank you, you alex. again uh, well, thank alex, you. speaking of speaking i'd love to beat off to you fucking one of my favorite dr. girls sickness on his page there on his twitter feed so <laughs> using a bunch God of double entendres here there you go like wait a minute uh This is hey guys, I've been watching a lot of ALS ice bucket challenges, and uh, I decided I just want to do it. So before I do mine, I just wanted to nominate people I want to do. The audio is not I English, know. more than normal. Uh, be first, uh, Justin from the this was intercepted uh, audio from a, 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 a spacecraft uh, so they saw hovering Harris, over West Texas, and it stayed still in the sky for seven hours straight. And to my friend Brady Goodman, and then to my friend. Profit, you could get out of doing the ice bucket challenge by just father, saying, uh, all right, all right. you couldn't understand your name. No, dude, I genuinely dude. didn't know what you said. <laughs> this is so true. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm freaking out. Hold on. It's very just weird. Did... Oh, shit. No, no, I didn't want what to do that. What could that be on? We got hit. We got it. We got oh, I love the these. Yeah, we gotta hit the classic. It's been a, a, a while since we watched this one. Make sure it's not the one with the guy that dies. Oh, shit. I'm just kidding. No, that was this oh, one. We just saw it. Yeah. Hey, how all of these. Maybe it was this one? Half of these boats are worth more than most houses in Michigan, which is crazy. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I think that is this one. I mean, that's a really good one anyway. Pathetic. Oh, broke the I broke the trampoline. They got it too oh. cold. This is the the girl Aaron Rodgers is dating. <laughs> we didn't even get to see her fall off the horse. This she one landed on it. Oh, that's, that's so. That's gotta Ow. hurt so bad. That is, that is concussion. It's being like smashed two thousand pounds of force on your skull. Caterpillar, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what a fast dog. <laughs> NRA is a chud, he deserves it. <laughs> you know what the R stands for? That's right. Rifle. 
Yeah. Oh, Armalite. Rifle. Armalite <laughs> rifle. <laughs> At least it was warm. Yeah. It's the Aki he was just guy. cooling off. He wasn't even doing the challenge. <laughs> oh, that's barely even a nice bucket challenge. Yeah. That's a pool fail. <laughs> you need to water it's so heavy long. when you fucking tip it over, huh, old man? Yeah, the one where people, the people who pour the bucket get hurt, those are my favorite. Mr. Leahy. Honey, honey. Oh. Is that really? Oh my god. You peed your pants? What? Oh my god, Cindy. Ew. That happened. Hey, if you mothers in chat know, you know, you sometimes you run up the stairs too quick, you pee a little bit. It happens. Jesus. You can do it after if you'd like. <laughs> if you like. Here we go. <laughs> oh, we didn't see that coming. Classic right here. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. This guy dies. This, this guy dies. Really this, yeah, uh, uh, <laughs> Death. Idiot. Kenzie said hi! <laughs> Hell yeah! People get dragged over the side and it's the funniest, for sure. <laughs> no one checks on the structural integrity of their deck. Bunk. <laughs> <laughs> Those are also really good, too. They just throw the whole bucket. No. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Never seen that one. That's great. That was a good one. Yeah. This is not to say, this is different, Tom. Yeah, a lot of ones I haven't seen. I bet there's soap on that floor from cleaning the ambulance. Oh, God. <laughs> and he busts his ass from that. Two, three. He's in the right place. <laughs> you can't sit on that. That's for babies. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's a great one. That's an AJ Soprano in Meadows. Meadow right there. So it's like hard. he was afraid. He was afraid of the water. Wow, they're in Greece. Oh! Oh! oh. Ow! Oh. I can feel that one. Oh, oh this oh. guy dies. Yeah, this is the one where he dies. They're in Hawaii oh here. My God. How do they even make that water? How do we know that water is actually cold? How do they? Put ice, how how do you get that much ice to make it ice water in the back of that? It's got to be outdoor temperature. Oh, yeah. That's what that's what the fail is. Is that it's clearly not an ice water. <laughs> yeah, you got to do it at a glacier. <laughs> the card table broke. You can't stand on that. Oh hell what yeah! Can go this wrong? Poor girl. Oh no! Watch out! Watch out! <laughs> What is that? <laughs> Bitch! Is that a flower? That was his principal that did that. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> that was Jack and Jill. Yeah, none of these are ice buckets. They didn't... No one knows how much they can lift. <laughs> hey, this is the guy from the Richmond North of Richmond song. A lot of people All learning right, for the first time that they can't lift 300 pounds of water. Oliver North. That's his name. Oh, this is this oh, is the guy that's, who dies. It's barely any water. Just do it. He doesn't want to pour it on her. <laughs> so much drama. <laughs> Try that in a small toilet. That's a good one. Uh. Suburban jazz hands. Oh, 
god. <laughs> that kid just face planted. <laughs> Jesus. Him crying after so funny. Listen. Oh, he leaned too far over. Another weak dad. Oh, 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 no. oh, oh my god! Oh, that that might be the best one I've ever seen. Oh, so, oh got it at the top, and then he fell too, and then took one of the kids down. Oh, that's oh, that perfect. cold water sure fucking hurts when it hits your head. It felt like the whole cooler hit me. <laughs> Yeah, that, that is. <laughs> oh, that's so good. That's the, yeah, that is the best one. Oh, I'm glad we, oh, nice save. I'm glad we got this new comp here. They should do this again. She called him slurs. His pirate's hat's crazy. Oh, no. Dominic Impestado. Dominic Impestado. It's probably that oh my guy. God. He did this for the campaign. He's lucky he didn't get paralyzed. Oh, why is the kid crying? <laughs> watch, how, watch how hard his head gets hit. There's the kid was scared. Oh, Put, turn this to like 0 0.25. Just... <laughs> Bro, <laughs> his head gets folded. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Watch his fucking head. It, it, it turtles into his body. <laughs> they didn't even come close. Why would you let them do it? <laughs> no thing Yeah, you're all. putting so much trust into a two-year-old. That, that thing weighs more than both of them combined. Maybe yeah. the toddlers worked for his competitors. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> no! Oh, fuck! Oh, it was the it corner, like too. Exploded. It was the corner. <laughs> It looked like his head exploded like a crate. Some of it was that I think it slides down the top of his head. But yeah. It really, it really hit him dead on. Dominic Impestato. <laughs> <laughs> Watch it. It looks like his head explodes. <laughs> <laughs> Not even come close. <laughs> Jefferson Parish in Louisiana. It looks so crazy. <laughs> it's it's fine to laugh at because he's clearly just like, ow, but holy fuck, bro. I think he's I also a Republican. Republican. Yeah, so, <coughs> I hope he's parallel. I'm just kidding. <laughs> he's probably smarter now. I hope he honest. has a big boo boo and it hurts. <laughs> he's woke now. That then the uncle yeah that made him woke. set him right. <laughs> like I hate you white children. Again. We need no future for white <laughs> children after what they dropped on me. <laughs> That's what woke is. I hate white children. <laughs> I hate white children. <laughs> oh, this is at the Breaking Bad house. I'm only breaking it's buckets. Oh, don't do it on a little kid. Challenge your friends, dumb fuck. Get up. Challenge your friends. <laughs> Yeah. Dude, you biffed it. We're gonna have to do it again. <laughs> oh my god. It really backfired that this injured people. You gave them ALS, dumbass. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Double kill. This is what happened to Lou Gehrig. They were trying to pour Gatorade on his head and they dropped it and it gave him Lou Gehrig's disease. You know, that's why they do you know, this. Uh, <laughs> you know Stephen King kept the cooler that hit him, and when he feels bad, he beats it up with a bat. Oh wow! Yeah, Stephen Hawking as well. Oh. Oh. Took a challenge by her, and I nominate Ty, Spencer, Talon, and Brian. Okay, go. You <laughs> can't stand on that shit. Guess I never tried. Okay, man. Okay, dude. I guess you have to have a first time you try to stand on a lawn chair or something like that and fall. Usually it happens when you lift that much kid. water. He barely he lost only like 20% of that water there. Water's heavy. Impressive. I'm nominating Shanley. Holy fuck, look at these albinos. Well, this is the one where the guy dies. How did you guys get a boat? <laughs> oh. She's at the. This you is know the, I had to do yeah, it to him. That's his walk. mom. <laughs> oh! 
<laughs> she throws the water on her. Lucky, lucky Luciano. <laughs> oh, coming man. soon. You cannot I'm let a three-year-old hold a fifty-gallon. Lucky or Luciano a should release. He should release merch this year. Yeah. Honestly, the ice bucket challenge is what set everybody's brain in motion that they gotta be epic and go viral. You know, I think that's where the. This Bro, it's so happen. much worse now with TikTok because it can be longer. Yeah, yeah. This was for Vine. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Oh my god. But this is why Vi why Vine compilations are so much better. No one wants to watch a TikTok compilation because people <laughs> will put in a, one of those. It's like a minute thirty seconds. Yeah, they're like, too long. The okay, I'm ready. That's why Vines are so good. You gotta get it in. <laughs> get to the point. It's like starting a song with the chorus. Or just like don't. I don't Know what to put in a compilation. Oh, yeah, it sucks when you it gets dragged down. You shouldn't but... ever have to scrub forward in a compilation because something's boring. Yeah, especially if it's old. Jesus! Oh. <laughs> God. <laughs> people, this was an evil thing that people did. Oh, <laughs> I love the So many people dropped a metal bucket on their kid's head. Oh. Dunk. Luckily, that was mostly the top of her head, it looked like, and not her face. <laughs> and these are the people that didn't donate money. That's the thing, too. They did this so they didn't have to donate no, money. Donate likes. Oh, what can go yeah, wrong they're... here? <laughs> this... oh. oh. Oh my god, it's so cool. <laughs> Oh, one of them was just ice. Look how rich these people are. They won't just donate. Fuck yeah, yeah, come on. <laughs> Look at this old bitch. Sorry. People would like it better if you just said I donated a thousand dollars. What can go wrong? Yeah, that's good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Now challenge someone. That's a good one. That's just that's just a wholesome one. That's a wholesome fail. Well, unless you Hopefully cry, he's... then he's a pussy. Thank God. This kid's gonna hit in the face. Oh no! <laughs> that video's in that's... South Central. Those Illinois. chairs are just designed to do that. Ice bucket challenge for Berkeley! Oh, Jesus! Whoa! Oh wow! He Holy shit! That was he was good. The fucking landing. He's done that before. And we are making a donation. Hold on. Let's, nope, they don't get do the dogs slow -mo. Slow -mo. Let's do a slow mo on that one. I want to see Dad stick that landing. That was kind of nutty. Look oh, at he that. realized he was falling and swung around. Managed not mm -hmm. to kick the kid. Doesn't wow. even show butt crack. No butt crack shown. He has high dexterity. Oh, you guys nice. think he's cool? Well, guess what? He's a police officer. Shelly Stowers and Shit. I accept the challenge of ALS, and we are making a donation, so that. we don't need any negative comments. <laughs> oh, don't put it on the dogs. They don't know about diseases. They just think you're being mean. Do the challenge! <laughs> no, I, my, I'm pretty sure my dog understood the concept of cancer. Oh, that's right. I have no way of proving it, but like... Uh, oh. She just knew. Ready? Uh -uh. Yeah, I wish dogs could understand their own mortality. That's the one thing I don't oh, like god. about them. <laughs> oh god. Yes! <laughs> Classic. God, the cooler, the cooler... That's, from, that's oh. in Boston, that's in Southie, you can tell by the buildings. That's the only container that Alex is from. Yep. That's right. I used to have that accent. I unlearned it. Stop <laughs> letting your kids do this. Alex was in class with a bunch of kids that couldn't say their Oz because it, even though from different parts of the country, we couldn't say the Oz because he's from Southie. I'm trying to get rid of this wotism. <laughs> You're either from Boston or Prince George. <laughs>